symmetry of polynomials given f of x equals to ax cube plus bx square plus cx plus d we have two questions here one is what is the condition for the given function to have even symmetry and part b is what is the condition for the given function to have odd symmetry well in these set of videos we will be exploring more about symmetry but here is a very general question which will give you kind of overall picture of symmetry of polynomials. Now when you look at the standard form of a polynomial in which you have number of terms in that case we can figure out whether the function has even symmetry or odd symmetry or neither by checking each term. Now if you have terms with only odd powers then the function will have odd symmetry but in case you have with even powers which are like this then you have even symmetry. So for this function to have odd symmetry we should have these terms which are odd. x cube is odd, x is odd, right? But to have even symmetry we should have these terms. So I'm writing E here for these two terms not the odd terms. So then it will have even symmetry, correct? So that is what we should conclude and we can prove it algebraically also and that is let's do the part one now which is what is the condition for the given function to have even symmetry so even symmetry really means that f of minus x is equals to f of x right then we say that the function is even correct now if I write x as minus x then x cube will become negative even x will become negative but negative x square will keep it as x square only correct and here we don't have any x it is x to the power of 0 0 is also even correct therefore that makes it even so to make this function even what is the condition the condition is that a should equal to c and that should equal to 0 only then the function will be even otherwise not you get the point that is to say that our function will be like this if a and c are 0 then the function will be bx square plus d right now this function is going to be even well if I replace x with minus x then what do I get f of minus x is equals to b times minus x square plus d right which is minus x square is x square so it is b x square plus d right and that is same as f of x and therefore it is even do you see that so that is how we can even prove it perfect now let us do the same exercise for part b well you can pause the video do it yourself and then check with my solution that'd be great now the question is what is the condition for the given function to have odd symmetry so for odd symmetry we don't want these even terms correct so in this case we'll say then in that case b is equals to d and is equals to zero right if that is the case then the function will look like what let's write it down in that case f of x is equals to ax cube plus cx right what is f of minus x? There'll be a of minus x q plus c of minus x, right? Okay, c of minus x. Now that minus x cube will make it negative, right? So we have minus a x cube, right? And minus c x minus c x. That is, of course, minus of f of x and therefore since f of minus x is equals to minus of fx we say that the function is odd right so this function is odd odd means symmetric about origin remember that so so that means this function will have odd symmetry if and only if b and d are equal to zero right that means the function is kind of having these two terms and not those even terms and this will have even symmetry if x cube and x coefficients are zero. So that is what we should understand from here. And we'll have a number of questions in the series to just check this 
out, right? Remember one thing, when we say even function, then they are symmetric about what? Symmetric about y-axis, a line which is y-axis. And if we are talking about odd symmetry, it is symmetric about a point, right? So symmetric about a point, and that point is origin, right? So that is what we understand by different kinds of symmetries of a polynomial. And if the function does not have even or odd symmetry, we say neither, right? So that is what it is. I hope that's absolutely clear. So go through some more examples to make it like sure. Okay, thank you.